first stations, 15 minutes total to travel and shoot. Um, Caleb. We'll, we'll be on the radios when you hear us say that's time. If you're in the middle of shooting, you can't sneak one more off. When we're on the range, you guys can help your teammates identify the silhouettes. The coaches cannot say anything. So when y'all call it out, the shooter says, got it. Everybody else is silent so they can hear commands in case somebody comes over the radio. We've got to say, hey, range cold, range hot. You know, you guys have to be paying attention. The first time your coach turns around and has to tell y'all to shut up on something going on and your grab ass not paying attention, you're done for the day. Done. You're not shooting. You were done. Okay. And you just cost your team zero points the rest of the game, right? He's the instructor. I'm shooting. He's going to hand me the loaded firearm. It's hot. I'm going to say, going hot, take my aim, shoot. I'm going to give it back to him, and he's going to make it safe, reload for the next guy, and that's how it's going to how it's gonna go. Range is hot. Going hot. There you go. There you go. Hit. Okay, boys, these are the hardest targets. Hit. Good. Two safety. What did you go on for? You gotta tell me. Okay. Hit. Yeah! We are live on the range, live on the range. Got 12, 12 minutes starting now. Man, it's, uh, it's tight for sure on time. Uh, 12 minutes to get in all the shoots. We got a big team, and so it's tough, but they're moving fast, they're making good shots. Going hot. We hot. Hit. Woo! Good job. Going number two. Good job! That's what I'm talking about. Good job. Oh. Hey, that's exactly what you're talking about. Give me some. Tell these boys where you aim. Do the tip of that cactus like that. No. Yeah, the top of it? Yeah, okay. like what? All right, Gunner. There you go. So whatever you did right there, do the same thing. 40 seconds right now. Only well, takes me 15. Do two on that one, two on that one. Sai, handle this. There you go, Sai! Yeah! Give me some, Sai! Yeah! Baby. Hey! Bye. How'd you boys do? Oh, I don't know. You know, we've been up here at Camp Rest and I had to go they back and pick up the red team, so. They don't just... call me shooter for nothing. Ooh. Yeah, so whatever their first shot was, it can't be five by five. It can only be five. Oh! Yeah, you can't better your score. or It's the first shot that hits, hits. Okay. So this would be five, 10, 30, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. You guys have 80. Uh -oh. uh, 35. Yeah, 35. So, oh, it might be a tied game. Holy oh. shit. Oh. Coach is messed up. The last one, apparently, there is five targets. 5, 10, 15, 20, and 30. Um, we didn't know that the first hit is what they take and that's it so we were like hey guys just go for all five so the whole team okay, is like hit two fives out of everything so we would have had a straight lead we didn't go for anything else for that if we would have known it was first shot we would have shot for higher if we didn't know everybody's one shot so we'll be in the middle of here dustin the biggest debate of the camp thus far we're only on day two so this is just the biggest the biggest debate thus far you have a bunch of alphas competing against each other and they're really competitive right so everybody here wants to win not just the kids but the counselors so now this is where you hit a crossroads right so this is the first big turmoil of the camp we're only on tuesday see we're only on tuesday how come everybody else play the score game right? We're headed over to the board where the belt is mounted to see how today's competition shook out. How are you feeling? Man, I feel good. My guys shot good today. We had some studs on the team, you know, some sharpshooters. So we'll see how it shook out. Can I get a big round of applause to Gunner? My man. 
Gunner shot a 58, ladies and gentlemen, out of a possible 84 points. Oh, damn. So Gunner did his damn thing. Jonah in second plate with a 56. So Jonah came right in behind on the red team. I hope everybody had fun and enjoyed it and loved it as much shooting as all your counselors love to do. Um, and it was killing us when you guys would miss and we want to be like, I don't know about the other teams with my team, I want to be like, just do this, just, oh man. You know, so um, five and six, the long ones, I think we almost clean sweep uh, goose egg. Everyone brought goose eggs home. Um, other than that, we had to retie the scores. There was a little bit of confusion. Um, black team with 267 points. Blue team. Yeah, yeah. Boy. Two, blue team with 200 points. We have red team in third place with 193. 190. 190 even. 190. And green team came in at 188 points. Oh, yeah. dang. Close. So, give you guys a hand. There's confusion in the um, collective points as a team, and you guys brought the goose egg on the bowling pins. Bowling bowling pins. pins. Yeah. That one uh, hurt you. That was our team. <laughs> the amount you guys grew from shooting yesterday, for some of you never shooting, to, I'll, I mean, I might give the family veneer team the MVP just because these boys went from not even know what a trigger was to slapping high scores. So I'm super happy with them. My man Noah, right here, Z, come on. Sai, Sai wasn't shooting nothing at first, and then he came in at the end. Figured so, out, man. Yeah. <laughs> so that's the thing about competition, and um, it's what gets me the worst is when I start something out poorly and I start to digress, I can't ever reel it back in. So there's a lot of you that started off bad, and at the end, I seen tons of growth. I was like, oh man, that's cool that you guys were able to reel it back in, pull it together, enjoy the fun. And do with me as an adult, I struggle with that the most. When things start going bad, I'm just I just start doubting, stupid gun, stupid win, this and so. For you guys to all do that is really cool. You should be very proud of yourselves. Um, archery is gonna be have you guys seen the targets? I mean, you guys are trying to shoot this one. That's nine yards is right here. The farthest one out there is 60 yards. I swear we're going to be three with the So depending on the wind tomorrow, if it's like this, we're going to play Frisbee. If it's a little bit windy, we're going to go shoot. I just got to, because wind and I think uh, Frisbee is going to be the most competitive, crazy game. Tomorrow's archery might be a little bit of luck. I don't know what's going on with that. <laughs>